well I have been out here quite a while guys <clears throat> where I live I live in a little teeny tiny town Oakland Maryland um, the pond I'm fishing at it's got mostly bluegill and bass in it largemouth bass which neither are cold water fish so I think what my issue is right now um, I think I am fishing and it's a little too cold for the type of fishing I'm trying to catch um, it's not working out so well for me guys but I know you subscribe to a fishing channel <laughs> you want to see some fishing well trust me I'm going to give you some fishing but if you can't catch anything then you can't show catching anything and staring out at water isn't exactly what you guys want to see but I am out here trying trying to get something trying to hook into I don't even care what I catch but I've tried big lures I've tried little lures last spring I tried crawl dad and I just fished him real slow the same style I do in summer and it worked perfect This year, I'm doing the same thing, it's just not working. Of course, last year, this time, it had like two feet of snow on the ground. This year, I mean, look at it. Nothing. No snow. Not even any sign that there was snow anytime soon. Or anytime lately, but... I think it hit like 75, 76 today. I guess that water being froze over for a couple months, I guess it's just too, still too cold to hook into anything. I guess it's too cold for them to be moving. I even googled, what do you use, what is a good cold water lure? And I went to like four different shops trying to find it. Finally find it. Used the same hook they tell me. The same lure. And I probably casted a total of probably 70 times. 60, 70 times. Nothing. I switched to a blue crawdad. I cast it out. It hits the water through maybe three seconds later. I get a little nibble. And like an idiot, I was excited. First fish of the year. I set the hook like King Kong. And turns out it was probably just something playing with it. And not really interested in eating it. Well, I haven't even had a bite since. I've tried different color called ads. I've tried small ones. I've tried the full size, and nothing's working. So I don't know what to tell you. Maybe I have a hobby that I really enjoy and I suck at it. Maybe that's it. I don't know. But I went to a spot where I know it's usually dynamite I guess just not this early in the year I 
I've watched all kinds of videos. Try finesse fishing, they say. Well, guess what? It ain't working. I've tried finesse fishing. I've tried reeling it across the top of the wall. I'm sitting here, like, half hour ago, 45 minutes, and I see this fish jump out of the water. Not literally jump out of the water, but, like, there was something on the water it wanted to eat. So it come up, that's told of it. So I tried the top water. I tried reeling, I tried leaving it sit. I just tried twitching it, I tried everything, and guess what? The same response as I'm getting now. Absolutely nothing. Of course it could be that I had something on my hook. I don't know, absolutely nothing. Discouraging, very, very discouraging. But, good news is, two weeks from, well, less than two weeks now, from today, I will be heading to Tennessee, fishing for blue catfish, and I know weather changes constantly, but it's supposed to be between 75 and 80 down there the time of year we're going I think it's the 4th of March 4th or 5th I'll be heading down there me and a couple of my buddies I guess we're going out on the Tennessee River I guess is what it is I don't know I've never been to Tennessee never done any catfish fishing so I've never been on a boat before, so this could be an experience, but I am going to post this anyways, even though I'm not getting anything. And I do apologize for that. Trust me. I want to see me catch a fish worse than you guys do. It just ain't happening today. So... Probably the only fishing video you guys are going to see of me catching anything will be in Tennessee and hopefully I can hook into some monsters. But it does not look like it's happening here. It is cooling off really fast though so maybe that's it. Um, but I guess if you guys have any advice on what to use for largemouth bass early in the year and techniques by all means I would love to hear your guys' advice um, this time last year is when I started fishing before that you couldn't get me in the around the water with a fishing pole to save my life so I do not know everything there is to know and I would love some advice so I will post this anyways but like I said, if somebody knows what they can use around the Maryland area for largemouth bass and a fishing technique, please do share it. Um, but yeah, I guess till next time, you just have to put up with me doing fishing reviews. And uh, maybe I'll post some videos of me shooting some guns. Until next time, peace.